What are you trying to do, Colonel? I don't have to explain myself to you. Look, your wife is gone. Look at her. She ain't coming back. But you can still save Take us. Take one more step and you're dead. I have the cure, all right? The doctors in Sydney will make more. We'll send helicopters. We'll save everyone. With a nuclear bomb? Kevin told us the plan. You're gonna kill everyone. Maybe I should start with you. I have no choice here, right? This virus threatens the entire bloody world. Benoit is lost either way. It's easy to kill millions of faceless nobodies, isn't it? Stay back! They hardly seem human! Stop! But killing someone you love? It's not so easy, is it? Son of a bitch! Shit! <laughs> He was right about one thing. Benoit is lost. If not him, then someone else will soon send a nuke with our name on it. The quicker we leave, the better. According to officials, Benoit is still under quarantine. The sought-after vacation destination, popular with celebrities and wealthy tourists alike, was ironically, originally, a penal colony and still houses one of the strictest maximum security prisons in the world. It is home to many dangerous criminals and terrorists, including Karen, the infamous hacker for hire who has worked for everyone from Al-Qaeda to the Yakuza. Meanwhile, news of the lethal virus on the island has caused a worldwide panic. Some have claimed that the virus is only the first wave of a massive international terrorist attack and that the intentions are global. Bernard Green, spokesman for the Australian Defence Force, denies the claims. There is no basis for these ridiculous rumours. The entire island is under military quarantine and a maximum security prison is completely secure. The hacker known as Karen and every other terrorist in prison there isn't going anywhere. Humanitarian aid is on its way, and you can be sure that the virus, or whatever it is, will not leave the island. The whole world anxiously watches what is happening in Benoit. For the moment, all flights in and out have been cancelled. Oh, shit, man, I can't believe we made it. At this point, I'll be goddamn glad to have all my old problems back. As long as the world is the way it used to be. It's not. And never will be. Trust me. 